Tonight, a Livingston staple, RY Timber, has announced it will be shutting down. It's a decision that will impact nearly 80 employees. The sawmill has been devastated by two fires in less than six months. The company was hoping to rebuild, but after the latest fire a week ago, the challenges were too great to overcome. The closure means there are now six major sawmills left in all of Montana. For longtime employees, this is a very sad day, but they're trying to stay positive. For them to go out and start a new life, find new jobs, and possibly move, um, difficult deal. Things happen for a reason, and who knows, maybe another sawmill company buys this place, and I'm sure we'll all see each other. Yep. Who knows, we might find jobs at the same place again, and then we get to drive <laughs> each other nuts again. <laughs> Montana Democratic Senator John Tester reacting to the news saying RY's closure after more than 25 years of creating good paying jobs and responsibly managing forests in Montana is tough news for Livingston. I'm ready to help the region rebound by working to ensure that folks have access to resources they need to support their families and communities. Meanwhile, Montana Republican Senator Steve Daines said the news of RY timber closing is extremely disappointing and I stand with RY and the community of Livingston during this hard time.